Ray, I'm going to play you something here. Mm. And I want you to listen to it. And now this is, we're going to have you put your journalism hat back on. Okay. Um, and I want you just, just to listen to this thing and tell me what you hear. Okay, we're going to do a little critique of television news here, just for the fun of it. So this is a little breaking news segment. This happens to be from CNN. I'm going to make it a little fun of CNN, but I'm not really... CNN is not the target of this. It's basically television news in general. So I'm going to play this little clip for you. It's breaking news from this morning when they were talking about the president. And I'm, I'll give you a hint. I'm looking for stylistic things, not necessarily content things. So here we go. And as of this morning, we have taken action. It has begun. Two American F-18 aircraft have dropped 500-pound laser-guided bombs on a mobile artillery piece used by ISIS in northern Iraq. Okay. What would you hear? Now, first of all, you heard the anchor. She's speaking urgently. What else did you hear? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm getting the information. That getting information. Was, right. There's an element to this that I think probably did not even register on your consciousness. Right. So I now, so now I'm going to I'm going to narrow your focus even further. Okay. And tell you that what I'm what I'm asking you to look and see if you even notice is part of the audio stream. So listen to it again, and see if you notice any audio in there other than the anchor's voice. And as of this morning, we have taken action. It has begun. Two American F-18 aircraft have dropped 500-pound laser-guided bombs on a mobile artillery piece used by ISIS in northern Iraq. I still see a, a, a stump. I'm look hearing on your face. a music. Maybe. Music. That's it. It's, I'm just hearing that's a music it. bed. That's it. A music bed. Now, what's in, interesting about that? Now, now I'm putting my television news director hat on for you. Okay. okay? Music beds for news. Now just think about this for a second. You're listening to a news story about us now once again opening fire and going to war with another country, and you got to hear dun da dun da dun da dun da dun boom ba boom ba boom dun da dun. Does that add to your news consumer experience for you? Well, this is what I'm going to say. I think viewers are trained to, at the beginning of a segment, expect that. So. For me to hear that, I'm assuming that was the beginning coming out of commercials, the beginning of the segment, and they're leading off with that story, coming back in with that music bed, which would fade, and then they'd get back into the story yeah. into the next. Yeah, right. They, they kept so, the music bed up throughout the um, right. throughout the report, all the way up to the toss to the live shot, where they had a reporter standing there. So she's giving you the information, and for about thirty seconds there, you hear dun 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 dun, boom right. boom 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 boom, right? Because and Ray, and you're exactly right. People expect it, but they don't really notice it. You could be a news consultant. That's believe, why believe I, it or not. I that's why it didn't register right. because I expected it. Now believe it or not, these get to be the subject of intense newsroom conversations. Because these things don't happen by accident. And sometimes they don't happen like they're supposed to. And you know, news directors they go out and they buy graphics packages and they expect certain things. They want the music. They want to be able to put, you know, breaking, oh, I got breaking news now. So you have to see a big breaking news banner and you got to hear the music. Dun, 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 dun. And if you don't hear it, then you go back and get a different graf graphics package or if you don't like, and swooshes. Swooshes are really big. As the graphics come in, you got the breaking news graphic and now here it comes at you. Swoosh. So yeah. they do these sound effects and sometimes they don't play. Where well, the news director's in the conversation, he'll say, uh, you know, I don't know who's running that audio, but I didn't hear the swoosh come up just right. So whoever's running our audio board, next time we play that little graphic with the breaking news that comes out at you, you tell that you tell that dude I want them audio pots all the way up because I gotta hear the swoosh. Cause this is important. We can't build an audience without our swooshes. Ray, I'm telling you. I I'm I know this. Cold sober here now. <laughs> I I know Even this. I, to I'm be losing backed. my voice, but not my mind. But I'm, the um, this does happen in news meetings. There'll be a news consultant, or maybe a news director, or maybe a news um, general manager who's going to want to know. You know, okay, well, how much do you know? We need to budget for the swooshes because you don't get them for free. You know, somebody's got to make those things. Mm -hmm. So you got to have a swoosh budget. So just just for grins, I want to tell you now. I've made up my own music bed mm -hmm. but i don't have any musicians here so you know you may uh, it's not particularly sophisticated but uh from now on when i do breaking news you may hear it 
He goes something like this. So you'll hear that, and I'll read the news. For instance, deadly train accident causes traffic closures. Officers say a man was hit and killed at 7th Avenue and 7th Street around 5.30 a.m. No word yet on the man's identity, but police say he was trying to beat the train across the track. Boom, 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 boom. See where I'm going with that? I do. Yeah, it's it's a very, very important part. Uh, we need to work on the swishes, though. And we will. But... Um, but I just thought, our, you know, our listeners, uh, hopefully, I know you didn't enjoy me coughing in your face. Like, Sorry about that, folks. I really do have asthma. <laughs> when I do these sound effects, it kicks off. But now you know a little bit about how television news works. And these get to be very serious conversations. Consultants have present presentations on the best swooshes and the best sound effects. Audio guys get in trouble. Oh, you didn't have the pot up high enough. I couldn't hear the swoosh. Yeah, because it's not all about the news. It's one of the things that drives us traditional journalists crazy. But yes, as news director, I got to tell you, I was a swoosh victim. Had to go out and buy swooshes and put them on the air. And that's one way we build ratings. See, you never know what you're going to learn on the Forest Car Show. 